AMS 2140 Vibration Sensors In this tutorial, I will show you how to use a variety of sensor types with the AMS 2140. As we review this technique, you'll note a visual reference to the CSI 2140. Please be aware that this product has been rebranded as AMS. There are many different vibration sensors on the market, and the AMS 2140 can work with most of them, provided the analyzer is correctly configured. Two of the most common types are accelerometers and displacement probes. Within just those two categories, there are many types, and their use is often specific to the application. Before using any sensor, check the data sheet provided by the vendor to select correct information in the analyzer. Simply put, accelerometers measure acceleration. The data collected by the sensor can be integrated with velocity or displacement data using software such as AMS Machinery Manager or firmware inside the data collector. The sensitivity of the sensor can vary, but most on the market are 100 millivolt per engineering unit, and they require an external power supply, which usually comes from the data collector. When configuring the data collector to work with the sensor, the two most important settings will be the sensitivity and confirming the power is turned on. On the AMS 2140, there are three ways to connect your accelerometers. If you are collecting only two channels of data, you can connect directly to the two Excel inputs on the collector. If you are collecting four channels of data, you have two options. You can connect splitter cables to the Excel inputs, or you can use your four-channel adapter. This adapter works with both accelerometers and displacement probes. So be sure you are connecting to the side where connectors are labeled Excel. This side has only four connectors, plus one connection to the collector. Displacement probes measure the distance between a machine's rotating element and its stationary housing. The sensitivity is more complicated because you may be working in either English or metric units. English units are most commonly 0.1 or 0.2 volts per engineering unit, while metric units are typically 0.003937 or 0.007874. Typically, displacement probes are permanently installed and have their own power supply. The two most important settings related to displacement probes will be sensitivity and confirming the power is turned off. Similar to accelerometers, you can connect the displacement probes in multiple ways. You can connect directly to the collector for a single signal, use a splitter cable to connect two probes for two signals, or use the four-channel adapter to collect four signals. What you see now is the home screen of the AMS 2140. Select F7, Advanced Analyze, then F1, Manual Analyze. Select F1, Set Analyze Mode, and choose Spectra. Select F2, Set Spectra Parameters. For this example, we will change the F max to 2000 Hz. We will use normal averaging, but increase to four averages. We need to specify the input, so select F12, Input Setup. Next, select F1 Select Input. There you see that we already have four sensors activated. Now select F7 Sensor Setup. For this example, we will use accelerometers. I see that the sensitivity and power setting are correct. If they are not, they can be corrected using F3 or F4. Input B is also correct, so I'll use Alt 2 to check the remaining sensors. Input C and D are also correct, so I am ready to collect data. Now I will start the machine. Data for the four spectra can be seen on the data collector. It can be stored in job mode using F9 Store Data. If I want to do similar data collection using displacement probes, I have to change the configuration in Analyze mode. When you arrive at the Analyze Setup screen, select F12 Input Setup. Then F7 Sensor Setup. Use F2 Change Sensor Type to select Displacement. The sensitivity is correct, but use F4 to turn the power off. Repeat these steps for inputs B, C, and D. 
and now I am ready to collect data using four displacement probes. And here you see the data coming into the collector. This concludes our tutorial. Please continue watching to select from other recommended tutorials or visit the AMS Reliability Channel for the AMS 2140 playlist. Additional product information can be found at emerson.com slash AMS 2140. Thank you for watching. Thank you.